I'm in a Morrison's car park in King Swinford. My wife and granddaughter are doing some shopping and that's Dilwyn. Of course, on the back seat there, we've just picked him up. He's had his hair done. He looks very nice indeed. Earlier this morning, we recorded the slots for Bayside Radio, fishing and Welsh football. And with my granddaughter staying with us at the moment, she got herself involved in that as well. You can listen to both of those slots this coming Thursday, 2.15 for the fishing and then an hour later for the Welsh football on Bayside Radio, based in Colwyn Bay. But you can listen on the internet and DAB as well. Check out the website and enjoy. That I've just occupied. I'm going to put the earplugs in and then she'll be with you in a moment or two. Um, we went to Himley Hall. I think it might have been a pond. Yeah. Um, no, we didn't catch anything, but um, we did. Well, once Gaga to let me have a go, um, I did try and catch it twice. Yeah. Hello Jeff, I'm back now. <laughs> no, absolutely Jeff and Naya, she stays, she stays with us every weekend anyway. And because it's obviously school holidays at the moment, she's staying for a little bit longer. And she said, can I come fishing with you? Now she has been before and she's actually caught fish as well. But this time I was lure fishing. And she came, she had a go, she had a couple of little takes as well, which was really good. But she said to me when she was out there, she said, this is so peaceful and it's really quiet and I can hear the birds singing. And I said to her, that's fantastic. And I thought to myself, Jeff, at that moment, she understood the real meaning of angling. No, Jeff Pranandar. Meg of Welsh football <laughs> there, Jeff. Yeah, it was a, a great a great win for Colwyn Bay, 5-0, as you say. No doubt about it. He's already got his eye on players, maybe spoken to them as well. He'll know exactly. He's been there long enough now to know exactly what players he needs, what players he wants to bring in to play the way that he wants to play and to obviously go for the prize that, as we've said on many occasions, unfortunately only one team can get, and that is promotion to the promised land. So if people are familiar with Bridgend, then that's Penabont in Welsh. But what we do when we travel a distance, which we're talking South Wales, of course, we always travel the night before. So that's Cardiff Met, Barrytown United, um, Penabont, Haverford West County, when we went to Carmarthen in the Welsh Cup this season, we will travel the night before and that means the players are much more refreshed. They don't have so far to travel on the day. And the thing with football, as we all know, it's all about small margins. 